Tomorrow, we're going to be looking at how to breathe properly. Today, we're going to be looking at how to breathe badly. Kind of makes more sense to do it that way around, doesn't it? What not to do and then how to do it, because then we can develop how to do it properly over the course of several days. Otherwise, we kind of get a little bit kind of cart before horse, isn't it, really? Otherwise. Uh, hello, uh, I'm Peter Stewart on Twitter. I'm Tweeter Stewart, T-W-E-T-E-R-S-T-E-W-A-R-T. This is today's episode of Get a Better Broadcast Podcast and Video Voice from the book of the same name when I get around to finishing it. A lot of people don't breathe properly. They do it from their chest or their throat. It's what you're doing if, when breathing, you raise your shoulders rather than expand your abdomen. And it means that air is only drawn into the upper part of your lungs. Uh, and, and that amounts to a very small part of your total lung capacity. And instead of using the large, specially built diaphragm for the made for the job of heavy lifting the rib cage, they're using the smaller, less efficient muscles instead. It's the military type kind of stomach in, chest out way of breathing that makes the shoulders rise and creates a pain in the neck, literally. Strain leads to pain, leads to shallower breathing, poor breath support and having to take a snatch of air every few words, leading to a choppy delivery and a thinner voice, and a lighter pitch. And it's exhausting for the speaker. It's not much fun to listen to either. The clavicular, or thoracic breathing, is what it's called, as in clavicle, It's detrimental to your shoulders, and your neck, and your voice, because it causes strain. Naturally, we breathe from our upper chest when we're in danger and nervous. <laughs> I've just seen a lion. And it triggers the flight or fight response. We need to learn what we knew as a baby, but we forgot en route from there to now, and that is how to breathe properly. And we'll go through that tomorrow as the podcast continues. From London, I'm Peter Stewart. Bop, bop, bop.